Hello lovelies and welcome to Intuitive Tarot with me, Susan. What okay, kind of messages do I have for you today? I'm seeing that your your family it's like you work away I'm speaking to a masculine or a female that's in a masculine energy you work away you're not working where you were brought up that's what I feel and your family live still where you were brought up and they're kind of saying to you you know, it's, it's time to come back home now. We don't want you to be alone. We don't like you being so far away. You know, your your brothers or sisters need you or, or your nephew or nieces need you. It's, it's time to come home. There's one sibling in particular that I feel that is desperate for you to come home. They're really struggling. And they won't admit that they are struggling to you because I feel like this is a feminine that's always got her life together. She's a very strong, very confident, very abundant feminine that has done well for herself. I feel like she's a mother. Oh, she's like a teacher. I feel like she's, this is like a mum, but she's also a teacher. And yeah, I'm definitely, she, she looks after children. There's children that listen to her every word that she takes care of. That's what I'm seeing. She's your rock. And um, you haven't come back home for a long period of time because of heartache. There was a lot of burdens. There was a lot of shit that went down. And um, I feel like going back home is opening another can of worms that you weren't ready to open up for a very long time. So you kind of stayed away. You kind of like put it on the back burner and you were like, no, I don't want to deal with it. But the more that you didn't deal with it, the more heavy uh, these burdens felt, the more deeper these cuts went the more sorrow and hurt it brought into your life. And there's something that is drawing you home. Whoever this, this heartache was with, my Divine Masculines, you still love this feminine. You are still drawn to this feminine. I feel like you're head over heels in love with this feminine. You fantasize about this feminine. All you ever do is think of this feminine. I don't know if you've got earth and fire in your chart. But there's, there's this moment, okay, where you're going to be put into each other's lives. I feel like... Okay. 
there's going to be an opportunity where you two are going to have to collab and you don't even realise that you're doing it. I feel like you're going to be like, say if you're sent away off to work and they're like, oh, you need to go and do this course I don't know, say in London, if you live in Wales, they're sending you to London and you're like, yeah, no problem, I'll go and do this course, I'll go and do it for three days. But actually what's happening is this feminine is also going on this course, even though you work in completely opposite jobs, for some reason you're being brought together. I'm not saying that that is what's going to happen, but I feel like there's that similar sort of thing that's going to happen. There's something like that that's bringing you together. Because you're meant to be in each other's lives. You know it. She knows it. Your family know it. This feminine is also connected to your home. Where you were brought up. And she's got earth and water in her chart. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. I feel like Scorpio, maybe a little bit of Cancer. You've got a lot of people that have got like Cancer around you. There's like family members who are Cancer signs. Yeah. This family member who is a cancer sign is going to help you heal, has been helping you heal. You can open up to them. You can talk to them, express how you're feeling. What do I do now? Is this right to do now? Am I feeling the right way? Is this the right thing to do? <sighs> There's been a long period of time since you spoke to this person. And I feel like there has been a lot of water underneath the bridge. There has been a lot of time that's passed. But I do feel like you feel ready. It's almost as if you can see a clear pathway leading straight to them. You're mad in love with this person. You may not tell anybody, but they know, and you know, even though you try to hide it, you know. <laughs> this is your message, my loves. I hope brought you clarity and understanding in your current situations. I'll see you all very, very soon. Take care, please. Bye.